plus I'll get into Colin Kaepernick and his hypocritical, idiotic self. You listen to Colin Kaepernick, you're acting like you can't decipher the difference between Cuba under Fidel Castro in the United States of America, where you're free to walk, talk, criticize, protest, while getting paid $12 million. I mean, what the hell are you talking about? This is unbelievable. No matter what you think it is, it ain't the same. And don't y'all worry, I'll get to Colin Kaepernick in a moment. Nuno, get my sound ready, please. So when they look at Colin Kaepernick and they say, what the hell are you talking about? Your protest was predicated on systemic oppression of minorities in the United States. How you wanted freedom for all people. I'm quoting Colin Kaepernick here. But you don't see how absurd that contradiction is? You don't see how somebody of Cuban descent like Armando Seguero or Dan Levitard or anybody else can find that to be flagrantly hypocritical? How can you be on a mission to eradicate those very remnants that exist in our society, but come across remotely as supportive of a dictator renowned for just those violations. It wasn't free speech. It was just recently when it was limited access granted to the damn internet. Talk about repressive regimes. Folks over here ain't going in shark infested waters to get over to Cuba. It's the other way around. But what they're saying is, is that your hypocrisy is so flagrant. Ignorance is the only insult that seems to fit perfectly for Colin Kaepernick. And not to just know how to shut the hell up and understand that there are certain things you just don't need to be speaking on. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.